Hi, everybody. As is usual, we are continuing on with our 100 mistakes that foreigners make whilst living and working in China. And today we are at failure number five, which is underestimating major differences between digital and traditional business. Now, digital business has become an important part of people's life in China, and it will be even more so in the future. After years of development, the business models of digital businesses have evolved into several types, O2O, online to offline, B2B, business to business, and B2C, business to consumer. Companies such as Tencent, Alibaba, JD.com, they always present to users an impression of high tech and youthfulness. Traditional companies are changing as well and embracing the digital age. There are numerous cases of digital transformation. Some of them are quite surprising when taking into consideration what their original business was. For example, JAC Motors is a, a car manufacturer, a Chinese car manufacturer based in Anhui province. And I've provided the link to their website. Um, they created an online shopping center, which is one of a kind when it comes to online car selling. It is the biggest car selling website in China. Some types of cars made by JAC Motors sell more online than they do offline, a trend that I have personally not seen in many Western economies. In 2015, JAC Motors CEO, uh, Mr. Anjin, realized that in-store sales would eventually end and online sales would take its place. He was a true visionary. That year, the board of JAC Motors decided to adopt a new strategic direction and transition into a digital business. Not giving up on the traditional retail outlets, car retail outlets, but also adding in the digital side of the business. Once the online shopping website was up, the site offered a series of new technologies for a better user experience, like VR test driving and displaying of the manufacturing factories. And its popularity grew in just a few months. And there are three reasons for JAC Motor success. First, it was the early bird of the industry to go digital. In 2015, when other car makers were obsessed about in-store sales, JSC Motors took the lead to expand their business to the internet, developing this website. The second reason for their success is that it provides a comprehensive service, including financial support, online test driving. It gives you the full experience that you would get in a retail store, but from home. Third, reason for its success is that it offers customers the ability to obtain discounts and bargains. Now, since then, which normally you would get in retail outlets, um, you know, if they were going through the spring promotion and whatnot, these have just been extended up onto the website as well. Now, since then, other automakers have also embraced the digital business following in the footsteps of JAC Motors and using their website, their, um, interaction with the users um, as a base platform for, for what they then created. Now, the biggest challenge for JAC Motors will be to maintain this advantage in the future, considering that all the other automakers are coming in and doing the same thing. Now, it is important when entering and expanding in the Chinese market to consider going digital, even for the most traditional of industries and sectors. Be that visionary, be that pioneer that is looking at your industry and sector and seeing how can we differentiate ourselves in the market from being this traditional product, this traditional sector, this traditional industry, and go digital. Now, the digital world has been even more impacted in China through the pandemic, through the lockdowns that are still continuing in China. So if you aren't digital, then obviously this is something where you're not going to hit the success rate that maybe some of your competitors or other industries and sectors will gain momentum. In. Now, if you would like to discuss your China strategy and going digital, then DM me and we can schedule a free complimentary call. And if you enjoyed the content of this video, click the subscribe button on YouTube so you can receive more content like this every day. If you're watching this video from LinkedIn, then connect with me um, and see what we're posting. Um, if you want to learn more also about what I do and what we do at Woodburn Accountants and Advisors, then check out our website at woodburnglobal.com. 
I look forward to seeing you again tomorrow. Have a great day. Take care and goodbye.